Bad luck, Andre. What impressed you most in Marin's game today? The way he was serving. He was serving really, really good, really high potentage, really strong. And uh, yeah, almost all the important points he was winning with the serve and was really, really tough to to read or to return. Rob Moore from Sunsport. I can see you're very disappointed. What would you have done differently in hindsight to try and change the outcome of that match? Uh, I would stay more calm uh, because, yeah, after the first set, I think I relaxed a bit and uh, straight away when I start, I start to think too much and when the things wasn't going my way, I start to show frustration and that's it. Then I dropped the second set completely, and then it's not easy when it's one all. Marin start to feel more confident, and he start to play better, and then it's not easy. So, is it not easy when the crowd seem to be for your opponent as well? Huh? Is it is it harder when the crowd seem to be cheering for your opponent at key mm. moments or not? No, mm. because normally when I was playing, especially when I was upcoming player, most of the time was more supporting others because there was no name. So it's something that's part of the game. Andre, you have a fantastic record on the tour, but at the slams, you just seem to get to the quarterfinals and not beyond. Do you know why that is, or is it just a matter of time for you? No, it's mental. Everything mental. I couldn't manage all the time. I couldn't manage the emotions the previous times. And now I was it was the closest ever time that I was able yeah, to go through to be in semis. And again, the same thing, I didn't manage the emotions. I don't know if I did it better compared to other matches. I mean, at least I did better score and I was closer than the other matches. But still, it's the same thing. Andre, Dan from RolandGarros.com. Every round was a gutsy win. What positives do you take from the five matches you played? I don't know, because there's so many things that I need to improve. and. Uh, Probably the most positive thing that I did one more quarterfinal. And yeah, that's it. The rest I need to improve so many things. So, and hopefully that's what I'm going to do now in the upcoming, because now I have a lot of few, <laughs> a lot of free weeks. So hopefully I will improve something. The way that Marin played against yourself and Daniel, do you think he could go all the way or to the final? What, where do you see him progressing? I don't know, to be honest. First of all, I don't know how Rune is playing because I only watch him on TV. I can talk about Root. Uh, on clay against Root will be really, really tough. I mean, I don't know how it's going to be the match of him, but in case if everything is okay and uh, that the way Root is playing is going to be really tough for Marin. And he need to play really, really great game and a uh, really ma great match to to win it. But for sure, he have chances. And I mean, in this stage, everything can happen. When it's semi-final, final, it's only one match. We obviously know you can't play in the UK now. So, what is your schedule? Are you going to play Stuttgart, Holland, for example, Mallorca? What What's your plans? Uh, I'm going to play Halle, and then probably I will take a bit off and prepare for America's swing full. And I appreciate you've spoken about this before, but now that it's going to sink in, now that the Roland Garros is done, what are your reflections of the fact that you cannot play the next Grand Slam? Uh, I did answer this question already. Yeah, so it's basically to answer the same thing. I mean, I did answer. The reason I ask is because it now sinks in. No, I mean, the, uh, my opinion is still the same, that it's, it's not about that they defend, ATP defend us or something. It's more about that uh, to show that we need to work together. Tournaments cannot take decision and break agreements and do whatever they want because it can be something, next time can be something different, can be different situation, not about players. And the most important thing is to work together. Only when the players defend the tournaments and tournaments defend the players. So it's, thank you. Thank you.